there lies the issue where your partner already has a child or probably has two, three, four children and a lot of people are not sure anymore if you should settle with this person. They were asking that tough question, should you settle with someone who already has children? And we've been asking this on social media, trying to sample opinions as well. And there are some mixed reactions. And so Michael Osse 59 says, yes and no. For me, so far as I love you, I don't have to love you with reasons. If I love you with reasons such as having a child already or whatever, it means I don't love you. Rather, I'm lasting after you. So it means that if things go away or fade, I'm not going to love you again. So far as I love you and you love me, we're good to go. The key word here is love, which he has mentioned about 10 times already. Irama says that if you love someone, having a child isn't an issue because you'll love everything about that person, be it a child or whatever. Now, if someone has a child and you love the person, definitely you'll love the child too and marry him or her. Easy to say, but would you actually love that child, especially in cases where the child is not ready to accept you? What do you do? Mate KJ says, love, love me. Okay, all right. Uh, Christian says, for me, one shouldn't marry someone with a child, but if they both wish so, then they can tie the knot. Marrying someone with a child can cause future problems of which we all are aware of. More Amma says, if, that, if the child's other parent is already married, then cool with me. But if not, then it's a big no. They become very intrusive in your relationship. That's true as well. Um, okay. So Mary Tarazina says that you have to be patient with a person that you love. Miss Obaya says it's not wrong to marry a partner with a child. When you love your partner absolutely, it is not wrong to love his child because children are a blessing from God. Even through that, you can also bear yours. If you love your partner, you love every circle surrounding him with understanding, patience, honesty, and so on and so forth. Drew Jr. says not everyone can actually marry someone who has a child already. If you know you can't, please stay away. And this one says, if I really love her, why not there are quite a number of messages on Facebook as well so let me see if I can get some if the dad of the child will let you have your peace of mind why not but some can actually put you through hell always wanting to see the child especially if he's single and rich same for women as well Joey says if you're comfortable with that I don't see why not good morning new day if you if it can uh, if it's from God, then no, uh, not getting this message. Sorry, D-boy. Uh, KK says, why? Okay. Uh, J22 says, if she's got up to 10 kids and willing to trust and respect me, I'm good to go. Because I don't believe love fuels marriage or relationship in our time. But trust and respect. That's deep. GH C says, I think it's unnecessary to do that. I will bear my own child and to look after someone else's child while it isn't mine. It'll be difficult, even if I love the lady. And Andrea says, not at all, because children grow to know definitely that you're not the father or mother and then they start being rebellious that's possible as well but at the same time I mean you should learn to be able to love someone else's child Anderson says it is relative if you can cope with that reality why not but what I won't condone is pretending to love the stepchild on the blind and on the blind side more treating the child better to keep off than pretend few messages and then I'll go to my guest Raven Knight says well it depends that's if you really love this person and you care about the child and can treat the child like your own even after you've given birth to your own biological children and raised them both to believe that they're blood well they are still blood anyway I mean indirectly then yeah you can why not but personally I wouldn't because I wouldn't want to raise someone else's child only for them to show up one day and say I want my child that is heartbreaking Dorita says the most important is love respect honesty no matter how many children you have everyone deserves happiness and Idrisu says to me I'm not going to marry a lady who has children with another man because sometimes the love uh, because the love still exists between them and that will give you sleepless nights final two then I introduce my guest so Nana Benyine Shan says yes it's not wrong at all I'm marrying the character of the lady not the child love is what I need in the relationship and children are a blessing from God and finally Bint Islam says those against it I'd like to ask do you mean to say your sisters or aunties who are born once and born two should remain single for the rest of their lives but we also have men who would also expect to get married to a woman who will take care of their children who are also born once and born twos it is a choice indeed it is a choice um Time to introduce my guests to you. They are not new to the show. First um, appearance on the show this year, by the way. And so welcome to 2020 on TV3 New Day. Good morning, how are you? Good morning. All right, so Kelly Daniels is a relationship <laughs> coach and also counselor Luchos is also a marriage counselor. What are you doing, counselor? My new look, 2020. <laughs> Hi guys! Oh no, it doesn't suit you. Don't do that. Would you marry someone with a child? Who? Absolutely. Nothing wrong. Nothing wrong Who? considering everything. You see, the thing is not about 
marrying someone with a child. Uh -huh. The thing is about the maturity in the heart of the person marrying oh, the person with a child, mm. knowing that the child is automatically yours, yeah. and it's and you, 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 it's your responsibility instantly. But when, when you want to take a woman, you must consider the fact that she, she's not alone. Yeah. You want to take a man, you must consider that she's not alone. You just have to ask yourself, can I take a person with a, a young child or an elderly child? Sometimes it's a plus or minus. If you, it's it's sometimes for people, it's better to marry someone whose children are adult children. I mean, yeah. they are they are grown. They want mm -hmm. their mother to be happy or their father to be happy. That's fine. But in a case where okay, the children are young, I mean, you have to know that your child with a woman is not the firstborn of that family. Nah. What? No. If I marry you and you already have a child, mm -hmm. and then we get ch children yeah. between us. Mm -hmm. The child I met with you is, is our first one. first, boy. okay, 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 yes, And then the, ch the children we have together follow suit. So okay. I wouldn't say because I'm not the father of the one you have, uh, before you met me, uh, he's the first child. No, 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 uh, he, I mean, he's not the first child. So he's the first child, and the children we have together would follow you. So but that's not, the elder it's brother. It's not easy to just love someone. And counsel, I'll ask you. Love this is as not well. cheap either. It's it's a commitment. Okay. You must love the person with the child, or forget it. Don't love the person at all. Why should the person throw away the child because the person is now in love? With well, you? they're not saying throw away the child, but then you entering the marriage. Uh, should consider. It's either you love both of them or you don't enter at all. Exactly. But it's not that but, easy. It, but, but, but that's what it entails if it must be this particular woman or this particular man you say you're in love with. Counselor, what if the child doesn't like you? What if you don't have that rapport with the child? Well, good morning. Happy New Year to all of you. And this is a new day and this is a new counselor here. I want Amen. to apologize that Amen. all the things I didn't talk about last year, I apologize for not talking about. Really? This year, anything that doesn't concern me, I also talk about it. I encourage you. Okay. Uh, the Bella, question now. Marrying somebody with a child is one of the biggest burden you can ever find on earth. Why is it a burden? People have done because it. Because they have the happiest family. No, it's a lie. They are, they are hypocrites. How are they hypocrites? They are ostriches. They are people who were raised by their stepmothers. And no, they, even, I mean, I they mean, even have a girl, better relationship girl, with their stepmothers than their biological anytime, mothers. Anytime you find a girl saying I have a better relationship with my step than my mother. There's mm -hmm. a problem. What is and the that's problem? what I was giving you a practical example of the we issue don't that need I that. What's the problem? And I'm telling you, I like life things. So What is the problem? The problem is that how on earth will you say somebody's mother or your father's has wife or husband is better than your biological? It means that you have been brainwashed negatively. By who? Huh. By whoever has made you love the modern Whoever Do you realize you've just changed finish? the topic right no, now? No, no, I've not changed the topic. My conversation is still in line. Well, he still says that, you know... Um, I'm telling you that marrying you know, somebody marrying someone with a child. who has a child is the biggest burden you can ever get yourself into. Okay. So, in the first place, before most of our shame queens working now, they're all B1, B2s. And so, there's a good challenge and the topic is timely. But majority of them now are scared to get married. Look at them in town now. And they are shamefully telling us that my happiness is my child. I've never regretted having this boy. Well, if it's because not this children boy. are a blessing. You see, this is one of the mistakes you are doing to your life. Blessing. Why don't you have one? Don't you want to be blessed? No, if God thinks it's right to have a child, mm -hmm. it will happen. I'm Stop sorry. God but... out of this no. conversation. Yeah, no, but let's no, not. Don't put wait, finger wait. In my eyes. Why you would ask. you? <laughs> Hold on. Uh, Kelly, why would you say that like saying that. a child Kelly, watch is a blessing? Well, no, watch, watch, watch. Never open your mouth listen, and say that listen. it is God. A God's child thing. is a blessing. Please, stop saying that. If your mother had a boss, you, you won't be here. Hello, hello. You are a still child. giving a wrong conversation. I'm just saying. So let me tell you, don't, don't just say that. Are you not a blessing to your parents? I, you, I'm, a, I'm a blessing because I was planned for. So if you're not planned I, for, if you're, you're not, not planned for, you are not. I mean, I say. That's so wrong. Everything that you think is wrong, I'm the one saying it. Every Keep your child no, no. born Can I finish? Every out child of wedlock is a blessing. Is a blessing. Oh. You cannot say that. Can no, yeah, you I won't wait for you that. to say wrong can things. I'll be careful for you here. No, you no, can't. But no. You, know, you can't. You can't. You can't. No. Can a child born out of wedlock is Kelly. a blessing. Kelly. The act that is might you. be wrong, but the product no, 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 cannot hello, be called a curse. Because the product of the blessing is a curse. Are you saying the child is a curse? Hello, hello, hello. Anyway, make your point. Let me flow now. Make your point. Well, write notes. Make a right point, by the way. Listen carefully. I'm saying that. I'm saying that. When you're saying I'm a blessing, I'm a blessing because I was planned for. 
I wasn't planned. So if you were not so planned, planned what, are, are you saying I'm oh, a care? Can I wasn't finish? No, no, no. You are hitting too hard. You, you, let, I wasn't let planned. Him land. He so says, you are not a blessing. Says, My parents weren't married well, before Kelly, I was born. So you are not a blessing. Kelly, hold on. So Kelly, hold you are struggling with making your blessings. No, no, no. Struggling? Did you say struggling? Becoming your blessing. Kelly, hold on. You let him make his point. Even though I have a feeling that we still will not agree. Anyway, your, but make your point. It's not what is make your point. my point. So make your point. Follow the point very carefully. Go ahead. I'm saying that marrying somebody with a child, all right, is a bedding. That's one. Mm -hmm. Number two, people have not been able to settle down the reason being that they have not understood what it means to have a child and to have somebody coming to love you. Mm -hmm. Now, Kelly Talking says that you should love the child the woman is having. One thing here. Every child you meet with a woman, the child is not your responsibility as a new husband in the life of the woman. The child is not. Why? Because in the first place, the father of that child must... Or the mother. The father of that child must be responsible for their what child. What if he's not okay. responsible? What so I had a child with someone, he denied the Can pregnancy. This I you are just, to you ask just this question. this thing. Wait. Pine, pine, hit that thing and let wait, go. Wait, you are saying that the parent no, shouldn't, no, no, be you're the you. shouldn't be the one responsible for the child. Yes. I had a baby with someone. Yes. He denied responsibility. Yes. I've been a born one for a while. You yes. come along and you mm -hmm. don't want to take responsibility. Okay, congratulations. And you love me. This is what, please. Love me, love my dog. No human being is a dog. So we don't love dogs. So listen, watch it here. I'm saying that. You are there, and that's the reason why most of our shame queens are not having husbands. Because their focus right now is that if you come into my life, you have to come and love this child. What do you mean by so, shame queens? You don't know them. He's about to slay queens, and he's tending uh, to shame that's the queens word. because okay. he wants so, to choose hmm. what he wants. I'm telling you, this man is I not mean, so, talking properly this morning. No, I, right, need, so you, I mean, let's, 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 let's land, Kelly, and I'll let you, you know in. what I'm saying. You're you are making a point. So let me let me say that their focus right now is that who will love this child I'm having. Who will love what the mistake I made? Mm -hmm. Who will love me with this? And that's what I say. That's what they are delaying. If you find somebody having children with somebody else, and the children are being taken care of, it's easy for the person to get a man to marry her. You know, this because conversation is not only about born ones. But it's about who? They are divorcees. It's the same conversation. So if I'm divorced, God forbid though, but if I do get divorced, some divorces years don't say God forbid. No, I'm marriage. just saying, so allow me to say it. Say so it. maybe I had three children in my previous marriage. My you. my husband to be also had maybe two children. Thank you. You're telling me that if we get so together, what you we should if take you have three kids and I'm divorced. The children I'm, I divorced you with, I still have to be responsible for the children. Yes, but what about so the new man no that excuse, comes in? My brother, my sister, there's no excuse for any man ever and her, his family. To re relegate their responsibility because the divorce or whatever I said. They are not relegated. So I'm saying that the first thing it's is just that circumstance. Circumstance being what? I, I'm no more interested in your marriage. Does it mean I'm no more interested in taking care of the children? Okay. So I'm saying that people come into focus, they want to get married. But their focus are the children. So there are most of them in a relationship. And they will call you and tell you, hello, Kelly, uh, Kweku, Junior doesn't want to do his homework. He says, unless you come. Please, can you pass by and assist him to do so? You become a homework work, worker. Kweku is not feeling well, and he's been mentioning your name. So, this is the guy you are dating, and your first focus is that for a guy to be able to marry me as born one, born two, the man must be interested in my children. That is your first error. No. It's an error? No. It's, it's your it first error, error if that oh, is your priority. Can I land? Oh, if that's if your that's, priority, he must, can I land? He must be attracted to you. you, you can you, I land? Talking. You have just one Stop minute to land. Stop your missed call so that I can land. Okay, you right have a minute to land, and then me. Kelly can come. Otherwise, I'll do the same to you. 2020. Listen carefully. So the first thing is that if your focus become love my child, so you can love me. Error mm -hmm. number two. Now the other thing is that you should be able to tell yourself that this child I have, I didn't plan for it, mm -hmm. so I'm careful. Of what? Of being. What I did, I don't repeat it. Okay. But a lot of people, what they did, which was a mistake that brought them this child, they've not stopped doing it. Hence, getting somebody to marry them is a challenge. Watch somebody who had unprotected sex and didn't know that this sex was going to land in pregnancy. Mm -hmm. It was not planned for. We're having fun. I realized I'm pregnant. Then I want to keep the child and have the child. The story behind the child will forever be told. He can become the president of Ghana. The story that brought this child into the world. So you check statistics says that we have 68% of children in the world unplanned for. Mm -hmm. That is what it is. And as oh, long okay. as we live not planning for the children, we have this chaotic situation. So my sister, okay. marrying people with children, first place, 
You'd have a lot to consider, but ask yourself, am I ready to marry you, Bella, and the baby's father? Because anytime you marry a woman who has a child, oh, or a man, man who has a child, child, you are marrying the man and the children's father. Mm -hmm. They cannot be out of your life. Mm -hmm. Whether they are dead, whether they are alive, whether they are mad, whether they are sick. So you don't just consider, love my child. Okay. You need to consider, where is this child coming from? We should stop that behavior. You should love them. If you love a woman, whatever is around her, you love together. It's okay. not true. Okay. I'll let you come back on this point. But let me ask this as well. So he's saying that you should consider all those things. But here lies the case where maybe the child likes you naturally. So you know sometimes you go to the house, you're dating the mom, and the child is always coming around you. That makes it even difficult to not want to take responsibility for the child. And here he is saying that you're not, it's not your responsibility to care for this child. What do you have to say about that? See, the, the issue on, on ground is this. Mm -hmm. Is it right or wrong mm -hmm. to have a single parent as a marital spouse? Mm -hmm. Is that not what we are discussing? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm saying that there's nothing wrong about it. Mm -hmm. All the factors he has mentioned might be valid for another topic, but the, but, but the how reason do you why tie we are in, here is how do you tie in the uh, the other parents? So whoever it is that left your partner, I have met a single parent, a woman. Uh -huh. I'm using myself because I'm, I'm I'm a man. Well, the father of the child mm -hmm. or children mm -hmm. of this woman mm -hmm. is alive mm -hmm. and is very, very active in their lives. Mm -hmm. It's just that they are not living together. Mm -hmm. I'm going to have to take up the responsibility if I want this woman. You can't <laughs> want the children over her. You, can, you, you must first make sure that she's the type of person that you are deliberately, oh intentionally mm -hmm. wanting to marry. And then before you think about every and any other thing about around her, you cannot call the children of the, the person you love a burden. Okay. or an encumbrance, or, or, or whatever else. They are responsibilities. For who? Can I talk? No, I'm talking. They are responsibilities you should choose or not choose <laughs> to adapt to. I'm myself. But once you take up a woman or uh -huh. a man, uh -huh. every person in her life literally becomes comes into your life too. It's not true. No, 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 hold on. Well, that's what no, he said, no, that no, you literally no. marry when, the other when, partner when, No, well. no, you don't marry. You, you, don't, you know oh. what, 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 well, what marry means? Well, indirectly. He is a part of the situation, and but he, will he is not. Be a part. He will always. So he's be. not paying the fees. Hold on, if he doesn't. So the pay woman the is the one working to pay the fees of the children. Am I going to marry you, you so that you still work? Okay, okay, okay. Hold on. Can are you, are you please about? be silent? No, but when the, when the other partner now, when is not the taking other responsibility, now, can, so, Bella, cannot, you're not taking responsibilities or cannot take responsibilities. And you can afford it. Please do. What if you it can't is, afford it? If you can't afford it, uh -huh. it's, it's understandable that you can't. So who Nobody cares for the would child? Blame f no, no, no. But you can't be blamed for the fact that the children cannot be paid. Oh I mean, so, the, the, but you are marrying her, so you oh. should automatically I am, take I have married you. There's no money. My children, the children I have with you, cannot come first before the children. I met in the marriage. How? They are all our children. No, uh -huh. no, 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 no. Yeah. If no, no, hold no. on, hold on, hold the on. The new children you have Can I talk? Are called Kelly Daniels. All right. The old ones you met, they are Luton, and they will die as Luton. They would bear they the person's heirs. name. But so listen, to me. listen to me. As long as we are married, the children you and I had before we got married are our children, regardless no. of the names they bear. They are not. Listen, you cannot make decisions on can behalf of my children in that marriage. Can he land? What are you talking about? Can he are, we, land? are we in a discussion? Yeah. No, we're not in a discussion. Oh, we're in a debate. Uh, Counter, point. hold on. Kelly land. Viewers, we are very sorry. This man, no, we apologize the nation has to pray for this man. I'm telling you that, Joe. Yo, Kelly, go I'm on. telling you the truth. <laughs> the nation has to pray for this man. They already the nation's pray. 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 pray for this man. They already pray. This is the point. There's no condition. The moment I say I love you, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and you say you love me, mm -hmm. I have a child, you have a child, or you have a child and I have none. Mm -hmm. Whatever child or children comes between us becomes our responsibility, yeah. regardless of the commitment of the parents of the child on the other side. Yeah. So if the person can pay, hallelujah. If the person cannot pay, I should have fostered in the responsibility of that child before proposing to you. Mm -hmm. So the moment I propose to you, that child's school fees becomes my responsibility the, child, the father dead or alive, or the mother dead or alive. Bella yeah. has a brilliant yeah. I know what that we will don't share. Have? Hello, hello. It, how can I not have? And if I don't have, I look for it. That's what men do. Mm. For the child. Live yeah. up to the responsibility. Yeah. So that the father of that child will be How working. do you now? Okay, hold on. 
How do you now control the shame. external Truth factors? And that what, includes the other parts now. The best way to control the external factors, which particularly concerns the other parents of the child, is to have a dialogue with the, with the, with the yep. other mother, I mean, uh, 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 other, other, other partner Wait, that has the children. Other, okay, so, the, so if I so want my to marry ex, you, yeah. I'm going to have a meeting with you. <laughs> hold on. Wait, with me. Okay, not with the such a wait, 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 hold on. Jesus not with the man I had listen, a child with. Listen, listen. The man with I am interested in you. Oh. Look trots. Kelly, carry on. If I am interested in you uh -huh. and you have a child, yeah. I'm going to ask you certain fundamental questions about the upbringing of the child. Okay. How did the child come come forth? Oh, you what what, what, what oh, were you the situations so surrounding you that. the yeah. child's birth? <laughs> Who is the father or the mother of the child? Uh -huh. How oh involving God. is the person oh in the God. child's life now? Yeah. You are repeating me. What family is the child coming from? <laughs> All Those that things are important. the things I must consider what before about, I say yes. What about the other so person? So if which other person? So the man I may have had the children you, with. I will, I will you believe that? everything you say about him. But what if he's been a nuisance? He doesn't if allow the kids to come close to fantastic. you. Fantastic. If the my, my the, the the father of my what what, what, what your wife, what's it called your stepchildren yes, my stepchildren yeah, your step. is a nuisance. There are ways to go about it. I'm married to you. Hold on. I'm married to you now. They are my responsibility, but I understand that we can share responsibilities. No, no, and no, any time no, no. you come for your children, want to share hold on. Shall it? Then the children have no place in the house. I'm on I'm on it. Okay. If the person decides no, I w I want my children to myself. I have no say. If the, if the person insists, well, they are with you, but I must pay their school fees, I have no say. Okay. <laughs> but I must make the children and the mother know that I'm interested in their welfare based on the capacity permitted me. Whatever transpired between them before I came into the scene is their business. So I, I know that I'm going to spend the rest of my life maintaining respect for whatever they share. That's okay. what it is. The, the most complicated case I have a, cases... a, a, a lady who has two children from two men. Mm hmm and she's in Canada. From two men. From two men. Well, one died, the other one um, um, some, somehow got married to... Anyway, whatever circumstance, irrelevant. Two men, now, yeah. she has two children from different men. And these two different men are from two different countries and none of them are in Canada. Any time this woman wants to travel out of Canada, she has to go and get a letter from the from two... Both. That And she's married. She has to go through the rigor of getting permission... A letter yeah, from the two yeah, men yeah. that oh my children are about to cross border and I'm and I'm giving my 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 yes to it, and none of them. Can you imagine having two biological children, none of them bearing same name? Mm -hmm. And so, so how so, do you manage? That's that's a headache. the husband has known what he was going into okay. before he said yes, yeah. and he's so fine with it. asking for the people's consent came even with his signature to say, please, we are asking that okay. you give us consent. So, basically, get ready for what you're going into, but don't call it a burden. Okay. Because you Counselor. chose it. Counselor, come in here. Bella, you see, and let, all let's that talk Kelly about is saying, the interference of the other partner. Thank you very much. You see, the reason why the girls are still not getting married is what we want to help them with 2020. This conversation... The guys are also not getting married. So no, why as for guys, they don't have problem. Why is it only The guys power? don't have problem. It's the girls that have problem because... Akukoba time on an embedded What does it mean? You don't understand this one? Akukoba time. Oh, I mean, Akukoba time. Akukoba time on an embedded So the chicken has her children following her. Thank you. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, they follow mm -hmm. their mother. Mm -hmm. The hen is the one that the, the hen, chicken I mean, follows yeah. Sorry, and yeah. not the cock. Okay. So when men have children, having somebody to marry them is not that difficult right because okay. most men look for caretakers right You've and not wives sensible, yeah. okay so be careful when a man is looking for a caretaker and not a wife to pose yourself as a wife Bella the problem is that anytime a man is looking for a caretaker and you come as a wife you lose the interest okay. of becoming a woman in that marriage mm. that is for the man's side okay and most girls today the way they have built their life around their mistake. Mm -hmm. And I'm saying the mistake. Now let me explain to you very carefully to understand. I have unprotected sex. Yeah. Not planned to have this child. When I realized I was pregnant, the man who had sexual intercourse with me, the first thing he said was that abort. Mm -hmm. I refused to abort. Yeah. I kept the child. So this child has been part of my struggle to where I've come to. 
So I hold on to this child like my everything. Mm -hmm. This child is my mistake. This child is my prosperity and my breakthrough. A new man is coming into my life. As is coming, this child has no connection with the father. Mm -hmm. These are the girls we have in Ghana. Let's talk and help them. They yeah, are so different story. You know, all of them. All different the girls. Story. Bella. Carry on. I'm, I'm saying, I'm just all, saying you keep talking story. to them. I say that all the girls, their connection with their children are stronger and more bonding than the connection of the children with, the with their fathers. Okay. They come on TV and you ask them. So the father of the child, he say he's not part of my life. Mm -hmm. All of them. All when they interview them, all the born ones in Ghana, that's what they tell you. Not all the born ones. I'm that's tell, not general life. There you are that, different stories. I'm telling you that all the born ones... The fact that you've spoken to a number I'm of them I'm saying that all the born ones in Carry Ghana, on, by the when way, you talk to them, they have no connection with the children's father. They are showing, they are showing the people on. that they can do it. Land on this so I can make some comments. So at the end of the day, with this connection with the child, you feeling that you are the wine child. When I marry you, mm -hmm. one, are you still going to work to take off the child you brought? Or your income will become just yours for the new children we are getting. Mm -hmm. This is why they are stagnant. So when you are coming into their life, they want to see your interest in the children they have. Yeah. But the most important thing is that my interest should not be in the child. My interest should be in you and the child you have. I should have a better connection of knowing what is the connection with this child and the father and their family. You haven't talked about the interference from the so other. So that's why I'm bringing See? interference in. Uh -huh. You, the woman I'm coming to meet, yeah. you have three children. And you don't talk to this children's family. The man who impregnated you, you have no connection with them. Uh -huh. Then I come into your life. Then I'm also supposed to come and become a husband to you and don't have any connection with this same boy's family. Yeah. What but about a connection with his family, but what? not the man? What? How do you have a connection well, with the family I mean, not the man? Are listen, you serious? There are mothers who are love you their grandchildren anyway. And so regardless of Hello? whether her son is with you, you or don't not, produce she's, all she's still Bella. a very pleasant person. What is wrong is wrong. It's about all the about grandchild. A calculated Girl, attempt please. by the two adults Girl, involved no, no, on no, how to raise the children to anyway. them. Bella. It's well, just as simple as that. Land on this and then I can read No, no, no. Kelly, hold on. You have your chance. Land on this. Can I land? Please, just a minute. So I can read You can't say that grandmother likes his children. But you have no connection with the children's father. Mind you, the child, one who has sexual intercourse with you, is the son and not the grandmother. Mm -hmm. The child belongs to the family. But I'm saying that the problem why people are not getting married properly right now is that they are having too much focus on the mistake they are, they are trying to protect. So when you come into them, they are expecting you to enjoy their mistake with them. Now, if you are working to take care of your child, your child that you are spending your money on, when I marry you, Will you still be in my house and working to take care of that child? Okay. Or rather, you want to find ways and means of bringing whoever that man is. So you have named a child. For example, I have a child with you, mm -hmm. and the child must be a gun. Yeah. And you are an airway. And because I didn't do anything, you named the child by yourself. So the gun child now is carrying an airway name. Mm -hmm. My question is that, if this child wants to go and marry in the future, mm -hmm. because there are three things in life, barrier, childbirth, and marriage. It, all these three things, they carry spiritual connotations. Mm -hmm. You need a family to support. So now that you have exempted me from the life of the child because you think you are the, the one in charge, yeah. when the child is going to get married, are you going to do an airway planning for, for an airway tradition for the child or a gang tradition for the child? If the child is going to marry, is it going to be a neutral or is it going to be the family? Okay. So these are the mistakes. Let me read your comments. Let, let, me, me, just let me just ask a question. Read. Okay. Are you now saying that it is wrong to uh -huh. marry a single parent? Yes. How can you say That's it's wrong? That's what counselors exactly. say. Exactly. So no how worries. can you say that? No worries. So let every me, single parent should go to comments. hell because they made some mistake or, 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 or some some let circumstance got them to We'll come, back, we'll come, come back to that. How can they I love it when Bella gets children? up to read what's up comments how, so how I can check it out. Thank mean. you. Shouts to okay, Miss G. We're proud of you, course mates. Keep the fire burning from Aladdin D Flex. Thank you very much. Good morning. My name is Benjamin Owusu from Agona Nyakrom. Marrying someone with a child or children isn't bad at all. It all dwells down on the grounds of maturity and uh, oh, well, it all dwells on the grounds of maturity and acceptance. Besides, many people are happily married but are virtually looking after other people's children without their knowledge. True. Prince Henry Kovoridia says, Good morning, TV3 New Day. Happy prosperous New Year to you all at Media General and God bless you and make you all stronger. I vociferously and vehemently disagree with Councillor Lutra's submission because what it means is when someone has a child and loses his or her parents, that person should not marry That's a different again. Story. Um, this is a widow. 
Hello, good morning, Bella. I'm 24 years widow, but she still has children. No, this is a widow. But and still has children. The widow would write is we're a not, performance. We're not no. classifying. We're yes, just I was saying to break down to that you. Let her once you have you know, children, Bella, should someone continue. marry you? Simple. Whether you're a widow, exactly. whether the man didn't take no care of you or not. No matter the circumstance. Hello, you're good morning, parent, Bella. I'm 24 years, you, you and I have a son a single with parent. my guy who passed away. Um, is he saying that I will not get a man to marry? Uh, hmm. From Seth or Sajifu, Seth Bankasim says, Good morning, TV3. Bella, I can't marry a woman with a child because there are lots of ladies out there searching for someone to marry without a child. And I can only marry a uh, born one if only I have a child. Okay. The child born out of wedlock is a blessing to who? Ishmael was born out of wedlock and was a blessing. But would... Hold on. Genesis chapter 16 verse 3. Okay. Uh, Hagar was married to Abraham before sexual intercourse. Okay, but would have been a problem in the house of Abraham, so he had to be sent out. Marrying no. someone with a child or children or is a problem, a problem on its own, and you have to cope with it. But you can't deny that it's a big issue. Whoever has a child expects that you love and accept the child first. And you cannot deny that if you ask that she returns the child to the other partner so you can have a love in life, the answer would be no. Good morning to the panel on New Day. Personally, I see nothing wrong with settling with a born one or two, but it will only enter into that pro I will only enter into that provided my partner takes responsibility of the child. And a child is only a blessing if the birth is a planned one and by choice, not by chance. A, B, inside of Busoka. That means you agree with Counselor Lutra. It's okay. Love overcomes every situation in marriage. If a man really loves the lady, the child shouldn't be the obstacle in that marriage. The man should take his responsibility. I'm Andrew from Boku. It's difficult to tie the knot with someone who already has a child because of the financial and emotional reasons. But the best thing to do is to overcome all these. So better go in if you can overcome. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Bella. What makes you think children are a blessing? When only God curses a woman with pregnancy, something that you are cares with is what you call a blessing? A child only becomes a blessing when billions are at home because that would only let you forget the curse from God. And for me, marrying a born one, never. What would let a man dump a lady if she were to be good enough or marriage material? No man would do that. It's just that after they are born one, they force themselves and pretend to be good. But marry them and see. Greetings to counselor. I see. Final one. Good morning, Bella. And good morning, TV3. What counselor is saying is true. No man on this earth can ever love someone's child, as we do say, is never true. I repeat, it is never true. Uh, marrying a lady with a child becomes a burden. Let's be sincere to ourselves. Except you gave birth with a lady. Let everybody carry his own cross. The other man said when you marry a lady with a child, that child automatically becomes your first child. Says who? Which constitution says that? If a man denies responsibility, you take the person on. Don't carry someone's wahala to another for the first time. And he says, for the first time, I agree with Councillor Lutros. Keep your comments coming in at TV3 Ghana and on WhatsApp as well, also uh, on social media. And so we'll be back with more. We're asking that if your partner already has a child or children, is it advisable to go ahead and settle with that person? Councillor Lutros, who is a marriage counselor, says no, you shouldn't. And of course, Kelly Daniels, also a relationship coach, says you should go ahead as long as you're ready to take responsibility for it. Now, we're going to ask the next question. No, you, you, your summary is not correct. I don't know. You said no. Kelly Daniels she, says that. She's the host, No, but she's ah, wrapping ah, up. Are you saying she's wrong? Right? Kelly Daniels says, says they that they don't have time. time. This man, when this is your turn, correct? Okay, no worries. Oh, I understand. Oh, oh. The child is But not now, can I, can I legally adopt the children? Especially yes, in the case where the man is not taking responsibility. Oh, I'm getting married to you and I want to be fact, the father of the children. Legality is the foundation of everything right, supposedly. Okay. So if, if this is happening and you don't want issues with the persons, that's a fantastic idea as a matter of fact. If you don't want issues with the persons, uh, other parents or, or family, mm -hmm. you go to court and say, I have married this woman. However, she has this and this and this and these children. Let us sign an agreement on how to relate mm -hmm. with ourselves pertaining to the upbringing of these children. When they begin to falter, the court stands in for you without you even lifting a finger. She That's why. talking about Two. adoption. So, he, adoption. Let him, let him learn it then. Oh, oh. Yeah. So, when it comes to adoption, is the child's father or mother dead or alive? Mm -hmm. You cannot adopt without their consent. Thank but you. they are not taking responsibility. You still, still cannot <laughs> adopt without their consent. But I want the children to take my name. How because can I am, you adopt my child when I'm, when I'm alive? Wait, so Bella, for five years, wait. For oh. five years, I've been Listen. dating you. Yes. The man is not taking care of you. He's yes. not taking care of the kids. Yes. So I am now paying the fees yes. of the children. Yes. Yes. Hold on. But that man's them. 
gave birth to those children. So I'm saying that this and guy was as children are not Let me tell you. Ho, 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 ho. Ah, what are you going no, to do? What, what, what are you going to do, eyes? Kelly? No, 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 no. Ah. Wait. So Tell them the truth. I'm fine. I've dated you, you know, her for, you know, I've dated her for five years. Yes, now yes. we're getting married. Uh -huh. And I've taken care of the child. Maybe from the onset, when you were pregnant, that's when I met you. That's one the was guy didn't take Christmas. responsibility. That's one who was sent Charlie. you? Oh, I'm holding your hand. You're still but talking. I met a woman Listen, I love. Who sent she you? She was going through me. a lot. I loved her. It is my turn. This Blue trot. NGO. So you shouldn't, are you saying so Bella, you shouldn't pay? Bella, please, who, who should sent talk? you? So if I, meet, if I meet a woman Bella, with children. So he should talk for me. Wait, wait. So, no, no, Let he me should ask wait. my question then. Is if I meet a woman yes. with children or mm. who is pregnant and the man is not taking care of the children and I take care of them, you're telling me that I'm wasting my time? No, you're yes. not wasting, you wasting your, wasting time, your but time, but that doesn't guarantee As an NGO, you legality for adoption. Time. As a you philanthropist, one person at a time. One person at a time. As an NGO. Father, you Lord, really I commit this man into your care. Kelly, Kelly. Kelly. No, it's not a joke. Wait, 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 wait. Need to pray. He was saying something. He was saying, was saying that. that. Hold on, Kelly. No, no, no. You won't let him speak. Was... Okay, go ahead. He will finish the time. Finish. The okay, time is already finish. up, so like, can we land? Talk -o. Now both of you will speak. Okay, let now, me wrap up. So my issue is that, you see, we have joked with this thing for a long time. And there are more girls who are, pro who are producing children out of wedlock. Right now, what I... This December... I read a channel that most girls now are becoming more wiser after we spoke. Mm. That if I'm not even ready to be the husband to you, the child's responsibility is on you. So now people who have, have a child with you, they make sure that the children are okay, they have a house for you, they are paying their fees. I'm telling you, any girl who is having a child with a responsible man will get a sensible man to marry you. Mm -hmm. Any girl... Sex Who is having a talk, child so with, a with a very man. responsible man? You get a sensible guy to marry you. How do you then not cross the line? Now, watch this. The simple thing here is that if I'm married to you, and today, if I leave my wife today, anybody who comes to marry my wife would never have any bedding because the children will still be my responsibility. But you will not allow your children to be close to the other No, man. no, it's not my allowing. That I told you from the beginning that the chicken follow the hen. Mm -hmm. So the children will forever be with their mother. And my responsibility as a father. I will prove to my children that I am their father. What if I don't agree for my children not, to live with not, you? I, it is not you. I, like what Pastor Love is doing with Christy. It's not what we are talking about. Can we not mention it? We will not Any, stop. Carry on. We will not stop. Disclaimer again. Truth. You anyway, can disclaim. The, the you reason saying? is that if you, the girl, have somebody taking care of the children properly, getting somebody to marry you is easier. Mm. But when I'm coming into your life to come and carry you as a wife, and carry your children to on top. That's what I'm saying. The girls should shine their eyes now. Let's begin to punish the men who are not being responsible after impregnating us. Mm. Stop naming other people's children. If you are a man and you are having somebody's wife or somebody's ex-wife or somebody's baby mama, remember you are a caretaker, not a father. Until you have your own children. Until you die, you are a caretaker. And Until you get, have your own children with a person. And immediately we get married. The first child in the marriage is the child we just had. Not, Not your, children. your children. Yes. Yeah. Hey, me, I have children before you came. Who is the wife now in the marriage? Mm -hmm. Me, me, the man. Kaya, Every man. man who has a child, wherever you have the child, your male is your firstborn. But you, Bella, as a woman, you come into the marriage. Every child you bring, my child become our firstborn. By a woman's okay. child cannot be a firstborn. So, Bella, we need to, I think that we didn't have time to tell them how to manage it. How to I manage Yeah, I, that's what I need. Maybe the producers well. will give us opportunity to help because this story Maybe we have to do like is a too much in this country. The boys are to struggling. Manage the children. Going to marry them. Because, and because they don't know how to segment their life. Okay. I don't think my time is up. Producer, can, can, do I have to go? I, I guess I time is up. We have to go. Bella, as I wrap up and leave, I'm going in two minutes, two seconds. Now, watch it here. One minute, please, for both of us. We all need to learn. We are all learning. And we are learning because. People who have done positive things, we should be able to credit, give them the credit. Honorable Adria Safo just got married recently. Brilliantly. You ask yourself, yes, he has children, but how did he get married? Because the man in his her life is being taking full responsibility of the children. But once I greet you, one twos, I greet you. If you want to marry, make sure that the men who have impregnated you hold them by their balls. Use every means for them to be responsible. Don't change any child's name. 0277 609. <sighs> 644. Come for help and marry properly. 0277 609 644. We have finished the program. All right. On Instagram, I am Kelly Daniels Office. Just follow right now and then DM me whatever the situation is. Just Kelly Daniels Office on Instagram. The, the WhatsApp line to call for counseling is 055 313 5074.
055-313-5074. Again, on Instagram, I am Kelly Daniels Office. On Facebook, I am Kelly Daniels. Now, this is what I'd say last. Listen, there is no straightforward way to handle every case. Every case comes with its own peculiarity. The peculiarity of a case determines how to handle that case in itself. So, yes, what if the father of the child has disowned the child? The family is there. The, all I'm saying is Ten this. Ten seconds, please. Please do things rightly with the fear of God at heart. Tradition will not take you far. What is the word of God saying concerning this situation? That's what's going to make you go far. Right. Otherwise, you'd keep hurting yourself and creating problems for the children yeah, involved. All right. Take Kelly care. Daniels at a later office time, on Instagram. As a later time, Sakamba. we'll talk about how to deal with yes. stepchildren very important. in marriages very and very important. In, in relationships as well. I'm very Thank you so much. Councillor Lutrot is a marriage Thank counselor. You. Happy, happy and, birthday. Um, Happy what? Happy birthday. Okay. And it's Kelly Daniels is a year. relationship Goodness. coach as well. Let me take your view on this, Crystal. What yeah. do you think? Um, well, I, I shared that earlier. Again, it's a personal thing. I say it's a personal thing. It depends on you and what you can take, what your beliefs are. I don't think there's anything wrong with marrying someone who already has a child. However, I think that in, a case, in my case, certainly, that, that, that means that I'm dealing with another woman. And it always depends on the relationship that the man has with the woman and yeah. the kind of woman that, that, that she is as well. Because some women are highly cantankerous and you wouldn't want that kind of drama later exactly. in your life. And so I personally would always look at that before I think of even es getting a man with a Especially child. Especially when maybe the other relationship didn't work because you were in the picture. Uh, and so the woman is already bitter about you and exactly. now you want to come and take over take care of her children. You know, There's no way she's going to allow you into her space. Exactly, exactly. And so that will make the marriage very difficult. Very difficult. And marriage is not just love. It's love and so many other things as well. And so if those other things are not working out, sometimes you may have to give it up, hmm. you know. But yeah, um, I, I don't know what the others are thinking. I, I think great, great comments have come through today. There's no right or wrong answer at the end of the day. Yeah. Don't be convicted about it. I think so. Okay. There's no right or wrong answer. I'd like to say a quick happy birthday also to Pastor Joshua Delagbeve of Global Evangelical Church in La Paz. May the Lord continue to bless, guide, and protect you and give you more wisdom and knowledge with understanding. That's from Ellie Gleam. Okay. Mathia Sentry Boy Siaku says, hmm, I was a victim when she told me that she had only one kid, only to realize that they were four. What? So you can imagine after sponsoring and nurturing for mm. them and their biological dad just pops up um, from somewhere. Moreover, most of such kids are ungrateful. It depends on the relationship that um, you know you have with them. Uh, Darlene Garo says, I'll marry even a born 10 as far as love is concerned. To me, there's nothing wrong with it. If you treat the children like your own, you'll be blessed abundantly. Now, mm. the other question, yes. should you marry for love? Should you marry for love? Yeah. Is love, love is all you need in marriage? Love is important. It's a, it's a nice... You, you see, you can't use love only in marriage because at some point, love would diminish. Hmm. At some point, it may even seem that like love is not there, you know. So there's love and so many other factors other as well. At some as point, well. you, you begin to even tolerate the person, yeah. you know. So love alone isn't enough, I think. It's tough. You have to add... Yeah, it, it is. But Ham. understanding this uh, can help you with your, yeah. your you know, journey.